the line schemes themselves. And in the air raid, we had big splits. So let's say we had three and we had five. And the quarterback was feet his his toes would be at five yards, heels at about five and a half, maybe six, depending on, on the height and the athleticism of the quarterback. We might sometimes we even deep him up from that. And then on the snap, he's gonna go, if he's a right-handed passer, he's gonna go left, right, left, and set. Uh, so he's gonna end up here at about nine to nine and a half on his drop and his depth. And up front, these guys would be working vertically to set. So let's take this guard right here. He's gonna set left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right. He's gonna end up setting off the ball. On his alignment, his helmet is gonna be at the center's, the bottom of the center's number, which is, so basically, when you draw this up, I really should draw it up like this. It looks like this. Or wider. So basically, we're going to be backed off the ball as far as we can. Well, if this is the line of scrimmage, what we've done here, is that's as far as that tackle can be. That's as close as that end can be. That's as close as that tackle can be. That's as close as that end can be. We've created space right here. That space represents time on every one of our pass plays down the field. For instance, why the sale one I just drew up. We, we need about three to three, two to get the ball off. Well, we've created probably a second, maybe a second and a half just by our alignment right here. So now half the battle is basically won. We've got to create another, another second and a half some other way. Well, we do that by setting vertically. So we're left, right, left, right, set, left, right, left, right, set. Same thing over here, same thing over here. All right, so the quarterback is slightly deeper. These guys have vertically set. In other words, they're going to keep their pads square. They come straight back. They're going to try and create more space for these guys to have to run into. And now you've eaten up maybe two-thirds of the time that you need before they ever have to fight the battle. All right, as these guys get into them, now, of course, it gets down protection and uh at some point, all pass protection becomes man protection. You have to actually block somebody. So at that point, we, we've probably covered about two seconds just by our line, our drop. Now we got to win the battle from about a second to a second and a half, theoretically. And uh, they get into us here. You got to win that battle. So that's the way the air raid would vertically set and the way we would take people off.